Municipal bonds posted strong performance in 2019, and that's due to a number of factors. Uh, in part, they followed the Treasury rally that uh, happened through the first half of the year, but in fact, even outstripped that, and muni to Treasury ratios are at some of their lowest points in, his, in history, so very pricey muni market at the moment. Um, retail buyers in the U.S. have been strong purchasers of municipal bonds, uh, particularly individuals that uh, were affected by the 2017 tax law changes with caps on state and local taxes. Uh, finally, at the end of the day, though, it's really just a supply and demand issue. Uh, net supply, um, there's net negative supply in the market, which means there's too much money chasing too little uh, new issue bonds. And so that's the principal reason that you've seen the price rally in the muni market to date. As we come up to the midpoint in the year, it might be a good idea for municipal bond investors to think about rebalancing their portfolio, both from a credit and duration perspective. So it may make sense to revisit a portfolio and think about putting some higher rated AA BAM insured bonds into the portfolio, which will protect against credit volatility and potentially price volatility if interest rates should turn and go higher. Well, there are a number of potential emerging risks in the municipal market uh, pensions are talked about ad nauseum and uh, are the 800-pound gorilla in the room. Uh, extreme weather events like the fires out in California are another that investors are talking about a lot. And then ratings volatility based on potential uh, court cases and other things that are going on in the market. So there are a number of factors that uh, investors should rightfully be concerned about and those are all items that BAM takes into consideration when we do our credit review before we uh, agree to insure a bond. All of that is exacerbated by the transparency issues in the municipal market. Uh, it's really only the, the best and highest rated that have a great track record of getting a lot of information out there on a timely basis. Uh, BAM thought about that uh, and thinks about it a lot with respect to our investors. We want our investors to understand the underlying credit as well as BAM's overlay, which of course is their, the irrevocable guarantee of principal and interest on a timely basis. So we publish three-page credit profiles, which we update annually, and it's a great summary of the credit uh, and uh, where it's been and, and hopefully where it's going uh, that investors can find on our website for free. In October of last year, BAM initiated a program that we call the Green Star Certification Program, uh, and what that does is for every transaction that BAM looks at for insurance, we have added on a supplement to our credit underwriting process where we determine whether or not that issuance is in alignment with the green bond principles issued by the International Capital Markets Association. We've now done over 30 transactions and almost $500 million of par in green bond certifications, which investors and issuers um, are starting to take to the market.